Hi guys, welcome to another video. If you've been watching my channel for a while, you probably know that I'm obsessed with Trader Joe's. And every time when I go to Trader Joe's, I always notice their skincare and personal care products. And I have tried some of them, but I've always wanted to try more. So in this video, I decided to do one full week of just Trader Joe's products for the face and the body and give you my honest review. And spoiler alert, I was actually able to find a couple of products, couple of new favorites that I'm definitely going to be repurchasing. So here is everything that I got for this video. So I got the all-in-one facial cleanser, the ultra hydrating gel moisturizer, a couple of sheet masks, the blueberry and acai facial scrub, the citrus body wash, the lavender salt scrub, and then two body butters. And now I'm gonna walk you quickly through my skincare routine. So I use the cleanser once a day, usually at night. I use the moisturizer twice a day, a.m. and p.m. I use the shower gel every day when I was taking a shower at night. I also use the body butters every day, just a different one. So I probably use this one twice and this one twice. And then for the scrubs, I use the facial scrub twice and the body one just once. So here is the before of my skin and my main thing was to see if these products will actually break me out. I wasn't expecting them to like make my skin drastically better obviously but just wanted to make sure that they don't make it worse. Good morning guys, it's day one and I'm about to use my cleanser and facial moisturizer for the first time. Okay, my face is wet. It feels very gentle, it's not super foamy, and it doesn't have any scent either. I like how my skin feels, like it's clean, but it's not stripped of its moisture, so that's good. And now I'm gonna try the moisturizer. This is what it looks like. Again, it doesn't have any fragrance, but it's... It has a little smell to it, which I don't really enjoy. Soaks in pretty quickly. <sighs> One thing that I don't like about this, like right off the bat, is the smell. It's just, I don't know. Hi guys, I just took a shower and cleansed my face and now I'm ready to try the sheet mask. It says that it soothes and revitalizes dull and tired skin, which is exactly what I need right now. Okay. It smells like chamomile. I usually don't like sheet masks because they're like gross and slimy. I would say this one is less gross, so we'll see. Okay, I will see you guys in 20 minutes. Now that the serum soaked in, my skin definitely feels very moisturized and like soft, so I feel like this mask was pretty good. But I'm also gonna finish with my moisturizer. Good morning guys. I just woke up and wanted to check out my skin after the mask last night. And I think it looks pretty good. It's definitely really hydrated and very soft. And that's not because of the moisturizer because I don't think it's that hydrating. But combined with the mask, it worked really well. I don't have as many bumps on my forehead. So yeah, overall I'm pretty happy. Okay guys, I'm getting ready to take a shower and I decided to try the lavender salt scrub for the first time. It's kind of interesting. It has a layer of oil at the top and I want to smell it on camera and tell you what I think. So yeah, it's sealed at the top. Smells legit, smells like lavender essential oil, which is exactly what I expected. Okay, can't wait to try it. Mm -hmm. 
So that was interesting. I really enjoyed the lavender scent. Like my entire bathroom smelled like lavender and I really enjoyed it. And it was also incredibly hydrating. But one big disadvantage for me was that my entire shower floor was super oily and I had to clean it afterwards. So I don't know if it's gonna be like that every time just because now the first time I had a ton of oil accumulated at the top and now the oil is not as much. So I wonder if I keep using it, if it's gonna get any better or not. I'm gonna give you guys an update. And now I think I wanna try the coconut body butter. I'm super excited because I love coconut. And yeah, let's see how it works. Oh my God, this smells like coconut ice cream. So good. Why do I wanna eat everything from Trader Joe's? This is incredible. Oh, this is so nice. I am actually obsessed with this. It's so good. I actually did not open it correctly. But I think this is like my new favorite body butter slash lotion. It smells amazing. The consistency is really good. I've tried other body butters that are really hard to like distribute, really hard to like make them soak into your skin. But this one is like seriously so good. If you like coconut, I think you're gonna be obsessed with this one. It's so good. Ah, oh my god, I love it. Okay guys, I'm gonna be trying the blueberry and acai facial scrub right now. I'm so excited. Oh my god, this smells like so good. I can't even like describe it to you. It literally smells like food. It smells like blueberries totally but oh my god i am literally obsessed with this i can't wait to try it on my face this is what it looks like up close my husband already tried it and he loved it oh my god i can't get over the smell like it's so good i'm gonna wet my face and then i'm gonna massage it onto my face Actually, I'm not sure if I was supposed to wet my face, but this is what we're doing. It feels really nice and gentle. But I think the scent is like my favorite thing ever. So my skin definitely feels like really fresh and exfoliated, really clean. And now I'm just gonna apply some moisturizer. Okay, now it's time to test the cucumber and avocado body butter. It smells pretty nice. This is the consistency of it. It feels pretty nice, but I feel like this is the type of scent that I would get bored of pretty quickly and I'm gonna start hating. I don't know, it's just... It kind of has that like melon scent. I know it's cucumber and avocado, but it, I don't know, reminds me of like melon, watermelon smell, which I don't really care for. I definitely like it less than the coconut butter though. It's not as moisturizing. It's just not as good, I don't think. But it's pretty decent. Overall, I think all the products performed really well and that is especially impressive considering how affordable they are. All of them were under $10. I'm not saying anything bad about any of these products, but just some of them impressed me a little bit more. So for the cleanser, I would say it had good consistency. It was a little bit more watery than what I'm used to, but overall I was pretty happy with it. I thought it was really gentle and it cleansed my skin pretty well. It doesn't have any fragrance, which is a good thing because fragrance can be really bad for you. I would probably rate this one four out of five. For the moisturizer, as I mentioned in the clips, there is no fragrance, but there is this like distinctive scent that I did not appreciate. I also think that this was not as hydrating as I would like in a moisturizer, and especially since it says ultra hydrating, I expected way more from this, but it's it was a decent one. I would say three out of five. For the shower gel, it's pretty basic, but I really enjoyed it because I really like citrusy smell and it was really refreshing, like great for the summer, but it's really, there's not much to say about this one. 
I enjoyed it, but it's again like a personal preference. If you like the scent, you will like it. It, it does a good job for sure. So for me, I rate it 4 out of 5 because I really enjoyed the smell. The body scrub. I have like very mixed feelings about this one. I really enjoyed the scent. It was very, very nice. At the same time, really like natural. And it was very fragrant while you were taking a shower. It almost felt like a aromatherapy it was also incredibly hydrating but it's super messy like it will definitely make your shower or tub really oily so you'll have to clean up afterwards so i would say i don't know i'll probably rate it four out of five just because i haven't tried a product like that it was really really hydrating and i'm impressed with it but it's just messy the facial scrub oh my god like this is such a new favorite for me it smells incredible and it does a really good job it's really gentle at the same time like you really feel like your skin is exfoliated and like softer than before so this is definitely five out of five for me i love it the sheet masks i don't have them anymore i used them up but i was really happy with them i'm generally not a huge fan of sheet masks because they can be like really messy and slimy and gross but these ones were pretty good and they were definitely really hydrating so I would also repurchase those in the future. I was really happy with them. So four out of five, just because they are sheet masks and it's not my preferred type of mask, but they were really, really good. Then for the body butters, the cucumber avocado one was decent. The scent was pleasant, but I got bored of it pretty quickly and like it started to annoy me somehow. I don't know, I can't explain it, but it was also not super hydrating like it was decently hydrating but it wasn't anything impressive to me so i would probably rate this one three out of five and then my holy grail the coconut body butter this was amazing definitely five out of five smells incredible the smell is also not like artificial or like it's not super strong like it's just the right amount of coconutty smell it's super hydrating soaks in really quickly so this is my other favorite from this video i would definitely buy that again and it, i recommend it to you guys so i would say the only product that i really did not like in this video was the moisturizer and again it was not bad it's just a personal preference and it was decent and it's definitely like an affordable option if you don't want to spend a lot of money so there were more products in the store that i did not buy for this video if you guys want me to make part two let me know in the comments down below i had a lot of fun so i'm happy to do it if you like this video please give it a thumbs up that really helps my channel if you like healthy lifestyle wellness self-care content make sure you subscribe and i will see you next week with another video bye guys